And today on the UMHB campus, the Crusaders getting a chance to celebrate their 2018 national title. And Mandy Knight was there for it all and has the latest from Belton. Uh, let's go back to 19. Okay, thank you very much. The 2018 season was a storybook ending for the Crusaders, and today the team celebrated with a special ceremony where players and fans got to spend time with each other. A lot of them keep saying that you know it's nice to actually see my face for the you know for the first time. They kind of see it a little bit while I take my helmet off, but it's uh, it's nice for they can uh, you know put my face to my name. And I've had a lot of little kids come up to me, you know, pictures and signing posters that they only want me to sign. So that's you know that kind of makes me feel special. It's just awesome the the uh, outpouring of support local townspeople, the proclamations, you know, it's just an incredible experience. And you know, it's been a, obviously a long road and something to really cherish. And th this is special for all of our players and coaches. It means an awful lot. Stagwell MVP TJ Josie came to UMHB to bring home their first national title. And after winning two, the feeling is surreal. When I first met with Coach Fredenberg and uh, I talked to him and he said he wanted, he wanted me to be the guy who helped them win their first one and then to be the guy who helped win two. It's a great achievement for, for us and for the team and the program. It means a lot being able to you know, be, uh, become a two-time national champion. TJ could have gone to a lot of places. He chose to come here to lead us to a national championship, and he did it. Incredible. You know, the last three years, he's lost one ball game. It says a lot. Reporting for Fox 44 Sports, I'm Mandy Knight.